Hey everyone, today in this video, I'm gonna walk you through the Yeedy C12 Pro Plus mobile app settings using the Yeedy app. If you're interested in this robot vacuum and mop or you wanna find out more about it, the link to it will be in the video description. First things first, when you're looking at the mobile app, here's what our device will look like set up, where from the screen, we have a couple of quick options. We can enter into our map and device settings. We can start a clean or have it return home to charge. In this case, we wanna select enter to be taken into our device to view more settings and features. Front and center, we have our map where we have our station option below it, where we can choose to empty the dustbin if we want to. Below that, we have three different tabs for three different cleaning options. So auto, room clean, so we can choose different rooms to clean or zone clean, and we can add up to five zones at one time. Depending on our clean, we can swipe up and then we can choose our cleaning preferences. Four different suction power levels, three different water flow rate levels, two different vibration frequencies for the mop, so you have two different options there and then two different cleaning pass options, one or two times. So pick and choose what you want there to set your cleaning preferences. And then we have more settings in the top right hand corner all the way over that first icon on the right is gonna be our settings gear icon where we can view our cleaning history, put this vacuum on a cleaning schedule. We can also view maintenance. So when it's time to replace certain parts and components of our vacuum. They give you a nice breakdown there. Then we have our cleaning sequence. If you wanna set and customize the sequence, you can do that right here. Further down, we have our intelligent settings here, auto empty, suction boost on carpet. You can toggle those on or off. Then we have additional settings like do not disturb and child lock. Auto resume as well too, where basically it will adjust charging time based on the remaining workload and resume unfinished cleaning tasks. I like to leave that on, personally. Then we have our language, about section, help section, and find my robot. So basic settings that are easy to find and navigate right there. And then our middle icon is gonna be our map management. We're in the top right-hand corner. We can quickly map our home. We can view our save maps. This supports up to three maps and then we can edit our maps. So we can add things like virtual walls. So in this case, no entry area, it could also be a no mopping area. And then we can do our no-go zones, drag and drop. So we could do multiple two if you want just a no entry or no mopping, pick and choose which boundary type you want. And again, you can add multiples of both. So no big deal there. And just everything's drag and drop, right? So just reposition it exactly where you want it on the map. So that's gonna be your virtual boundaries and barriers. We also have our room settings here. So look at this, we can rename the rooms. We can pick the different icons and confirm. We can divide the rooms. So choose which rooms you wanna divide. So you could split that room up if you wanted to. We could also combine rooms. So in this case, maybe we'll combine all three of those rooms. If we wanted to, you could do that right there. Hit combine and it's gonna work on editing the map for you. And now our rooms have been consolidated. So very simple to edit the map exactly how you want it for your environment. And then that leads us to the furthest to the left icon in the top right hand corner. That's gonna be those two squares where basically it's your map display. You can toggle on or off things like the layout, the color, the name and the sequence right there from the map. So you can adjust all those settings right there within the app. So that's a quick look at the Yeedy C12 Pro Plus with the Yeedy app available for iOS and Android devices.